My name is Monica Andrews and I am a studio artist in the E1 Collective. I am very excited to be here. This is my second Art Hop. So Art Hop in 2021 was my first time around and that was just such a really incredible experience for me as an artist to see the community come out and support us and want to learn from us and explore everyone's works. I'm, I'm really fortunate and excited to be here. Well, I was a pretty creative child and I grew up in an artistic household, so I was really lucky to be exposed to it from a young age and then continue it now through to adulthood. I grew up in the household of a graphic designer, so sort of that boldness and experimenting with colors has always been part of what I've been exposed to. So a lot of it was my own experimentation with, you know, doing logos and things like that and simplifying things down into certain colorways. So I feel like that was a big influence in sort of my graphic qualities to my artwork. My style is pretty bold and colorful. I really like black outlines and a lot of fun, bright colors in your face. For more time intensive and realistic work, like I do pet portraits and in-person portraits. For that, I do a lot of um, studying different angles of faces and playing with the composition and doing sketches. For other stuff that's a little bit more abstract, sometimes I kind of just like to throw myself into it and abandon all of my um, training and sometimes it's successful, sometimes it's not. <laughs> right now, I really like this um, sort of flower tattoo inspired uh, cut foam painting that I did. I'm really inspired by American traditional tattoo um, stylings. So being able to translate that into a graphic painting was really fun. <laughs> For me, my story is also that I'm not a full-time artist. I work full-time at Shelburne Museum um, in the education department. So being able to balance sort of my passion outside of my work passion um, and being able to find time and make time for artistry has been a challenge, but um, one that I'm really excited that I was able to work into my life. So I guess proving to people that you can do both, um, it might take some blood, sweat and tears, but you can. <laughs>